Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Hi Sagittarius, fire sign. Today I am going to do a reading for those who are in separation and no contact. This is general may or may not resonate everyone. So take what resonates and leave the rest. If you like my content, please do like the video guys. Then it will reach more people. And thank you so much for supporting me. And if anyone wants a personal reading, comment me in comment box. It is chargeable. So let's see your messages. Sagittarius, fire signs, moon rising and Venus. So first we will see what is the blockage in your relationship, okay? Sagittarius, fire sign, sun, moon, rising and Venus. Let's see what is the blockage. Okay. The blockage is overthinking and ghosting energy. So one person always ghosting the other person in this connection without note, without saying anything, without giving any notice <laughs> or without uh, uh, any intimation. One person is suddenly ghosting the other person. That is the main blockage in this relationship. And the magician, definitely one person in this relationship is a manipulator or they're just saying words, not doing anything. So here one person is really damn serious about this relationship, but one person is not. That is the main blockage. One person is a manipulator, always saying words, but not taking any action. So ghosting other person a lot. So this leads to the separation, what I'm getting, because the other person fed up with the, with the other person behavior. So... I think in in my point of view, it is you Sagittarius, you took your power back and you just seeking justice and maybe you walked away or uh, you're fed up with their behavior. So that's why right now you both are in separation. So right now I'm seeing a lot of confusing energy. So let's see your person current feelings and the true intentions. your person current feelings and your person true intentions under the deck four of pentacles yeah so your person right now going through a tower moment definitely but they are uh, not expressing their feelings or they don't want to express their feelings because the high priestess and four of pentacles Due to your person is in the Empress energy, they don't want to express their feelings. Your person is very, very stubborn and they are good at uh, how to control their feelings uh, and uh, the sun. But they right now started thinking of you very positively because the sun card is here. Some of you are dealing with Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. But their intentions, the Empress and Ten of Pentacles, it's all about stability. So I want to pull one more card. Yeah, they are in the process of making some important decisions regarding this relationship. Definitely they do thinking about stability right now, but your person is an empress energy. So they are trying to hide their feelings right now. But they want to make a decision regarding stability and commitment. So let's see your current feelings.
four of wands, page of cups, and seven of cups. I already told you, you are in some confusing energy, Sagittarius. You want stability, you want commitment, but right now you are expecting apology, you are expecting communication, but you are still wishing for this connection. Yes, you are seeking justice. Some of you are dealing with uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, fire sign, or Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, water sign, or Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. A lot of air energy is also here, but you are seeking justice, but at the same time, uh, you are expecting apology, you are expecting communication from their end. So let's see you post the next action. Will they take any action or not? But you are in so much confusion right now. Some of you, maybe you have other options also. But right now you are focusing only. Uh, you are focusing on your person only right now. Three of Pentacles, Page of Swords and King of Swords under the deck. See, Six of Cups. Your person want reconciliation. It's a, again double confirmation. They're feeling sad, but they don't want to express their feelings. Uh, your person is being stubborn with you. Maybe they are showing that they are okay without you, but deep down, they're very sad. Uh, they are ready for partnership. They are ready for equal give and take, but right now they are not ready for uh, expressing their feelings. They're spying you on social media. They're watching you on social media. Uh, but uh, their ego is stopping them or right now they don't want to express their feelings, whatever it may be. But right now your person is uh, don't want to express their feelings, but they do want you. Because six of cups, it's all about reconciliation energy. Five of cups, they're missing you a lot. They're feeling sad without you. So let's see. Do you want to take action from your and Sagittarius? No, you don't want to take any action because four of pentacles and nine of wands, you want to guard it up. Some of you already guard it up. If not, you want to guard it up. And four of pentacles, you don't want to express your feelings. And eight of pentacles, you are just focusing on yourself. You're just focusing on your work. Yes, you are missing them, but you don't want to take any action. So let's see what is the near future outcome of this relationship and where this relationship is headed. Seven of Wands, Seven of Pentacles, and see, Page of Wands. You both are on the same page, mirroring each other a lot. You both want this relationship, ready to fight for this relationship, but you both are in waiting period. You both are waiting for this communication, and you both wishing for this connection. <laughs> so let's clarify the outcome. Have passion, missing each other, and you both missing each other a lot. Want this relationship. If you both want this relationship, you both need to make a move. Otherwise, you both will be stuck like this. Some of you are dealing with Scorpio water sign. There is passion. You both are waiting for each other's communication. You both are waiting for each other, but nobody is taking action here. That is the main blockage. So let's see. What is the advice for you regarding this relationship or situation? The fool. You both need to take action. That is the main advice because the fool is all about new beginnings and the star. So, take the action. The star means uh, definitely there will be a hopeful situation. So, let's clarify the fool. So, heal yourself. Then, take action. Everything will be fine. And don't be at some crossroads. Be clear about what do you want from this relationship. So, heal yourself. Heal from this ten of swords pain. Then, you will see a beautiful new beginning. Ace of cups. And love yourself also. So this is the reading for you guys. Hope it resonates to you. Please do share, like and subscribe my channel and click the bell icon. Then you will get all my video notifications. Thank you so much for watching and supporting me. Please do share, like and subscribe. Thank you.